one of my duties as tap room manager, before we can even hire anybody, because there's only three of us that run this whole place, is the A to take orders and to make cans. We're spraying, sanitized with iodine-based spray. We're gonna do margarita this time. Sanitize the top. Put that right on here. And this is the fun part. Everybody likes to come up here, press this button, hold it down, test it, and you got a can made. These are some of our labels. We call them our house labels. All right, as you see, we call it the bumper. So we just write on there what beer we're putting in there and slap a label on. It has our mark and stuff in it. Awesome. So I guess you're wondering, how do we make the beer here? All right, I think Davey's gonna show you that. How y'all doing? Once again, I'm Dave, um, head brewer, and welcome to my garage. <laughs> I have my boil kettle and my mash tun. Here at Patuxent, we, we run a three barrel system. When I mean three barrels, a barrel of beer is 31 gallons, so we make three barrels at a time. On the other side, we have our mash tun. It's a giant tea bag. <laughs> it's just what it is. It has a false bottom on the end of it where the water can drip through and we run an infinity loop back through everything. And from there, from the mash tun, we go back into the boil kettle. After we go into the boil kettle, we cool it down. From there, we go into the fermenters. As being a nano brewery, we ferment in plastic right now because it's cost efficient for us. We add our yeast and that's where the magic happens. From there, we keg. So once we keg our beer, the, the cool part, and this is when I come in, when I get off of work, is rock and roll time. So we carbonate our beer. So we hook it up to the CO2 and basically we don't have a cool system. We play music, we'll play two or three songs and the whole time we're rock and rolling our kids, feel nice and carbonated. And then we stick them into our custom made freezer for the tap room. They could be ready to go.